Oh, we continue to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month, and today we are taking a trip to Peru. Our next guest is introducing us to some of the most powerful healing effects. These foods on the planet, which are so good for you, and they hail from the Andes to the Amazon. Joining us this morning, registered dietitian and author of Peruvian Power Foods, Manuel Villacorta. Yes, good, good morning. morning. Good Thank you for you. having me, yes. Okay, uh, a lot of these things might be new to people listening. They've never heard of them before. Mm -hmm. But what is it about Peru that has these sort of power foods? Yes, you know, it's their soils, the untouched soils, the volcanic soils that yeah. make the nutrients very powerful. And this is, we have these newly discovered foods, yeah. but we have been using it for years in Peru. All right, let's start with this first. This looks so yummy, and, and I have to say I've seen these before. Pichu berries, yeah. I never yeah. really knew what they were. Now, pichu berries are a fruit from the Andes of Peru. Mm -hmm. They're uh, rich in antioxidants, vitamin D, B12, protein, and low glycemic, okay. and actually they're quite delicious. So I made a pichu berry bread with quinoa, which is another power really food. really yummy. Okay. It is delicious. It's gluten-free, and uh, it's one of my favorite Very creations. Good. Yes. And if I were to just taste these on their own, are they tart, sweet? Sweet and tart. That's mm -hmm. what makes them so special. Mm. Okay, yes. while I chew, you <laughs> tell me about this oil, that, so, why it's so good for us. Yes, so Sacha Inchi, the seed, is the Inca peanut. It's from the mm. Amazon, and what makes it so powerful is the content of omega-3s. Mm -hmm. It's actually the seed with most content of omega-3 really? on the planet. Yeah, yes. we always hear about how good omega-3s are for Anti-inflammatory. Yeah. So it's really good brain food, anti-inflammatory, and it actually we make oil out of that. Okay, so you can get it in either form, but easier to use the oil. Oh, the oil, the seeds, as the snacks, exactly. Everyone loves pancakes. Yes. Or any form of pancakes. What is it about these that make them so good? Well, I made it with purple corn and lucuma. 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 Yes. What's is lucuma? lucuma is a fruit from the Amazon as well. Low glycemic, 25, mm -hmm. with potent uh, beta carotene and also anti inflammatory. Okay, and it comes like this if you were to find it, it comes at the in store. It's a powder, it's a whole food powder. So okay. That's right. Mm -hmm. So you would add it like you would a flour and or. Shakes, yeah. exactly. Yes, okay. very nice. Beautiful dish right here with some roasted veggies. I love but what's that. so good is these Peruvian purple potatoes. The purple potatoes, so good because they're rich in anti anthocyanins, a phytochemical that actually is brain food and anti cancer as well. Yeah. So use purple potatoes, I roast with them, and I have many, many dishes with that. And they're fun to use. I mean, you can definitely find those at the grocery store That's most right. of the time. Okay, this next you made a lovely sort of meatloaf, meatloaf. but you infused it with some things that are good for us. Kiwicha, I call Kiwicha. it. Kiwicha is one of my favorite uh, uh, seeds, grain. It's high in protein, also antioxidants. Which it's, one is the kiwicha? Is it so this, this kiwicha is quinoa's little sister. Quinoa's little sister. I like to pop it, so I have pop kiwicha, ah. and we use pop kiwicha and instead of breadcrumbs. So I put it in the meatloaf. Smart. Yes, you can make candies. You can make many things with that. It's mm. all over the Andes. Okay, and then last but not least, uh, these look like delicious kind yes. of pieces maca, of fudge. Maca. Maca. Maca is a root, and it comes in a powder form. Okay. And it's known to increase energy mm -hmm. as an adaptogen. So, you know, everyday stresses kind of takes you out of equilibrium. So maca yeah. brings everything out of equilibrium. Ah. And also it increases sexual drive. And this is what we like maca about. Uh, <laughs> ah. Another thing the Peruvians oh, can you know. help us with, huh? Well, this you know, stories maca. tell us that Incas took maca before war and battles for energy and strength. We learn something new every day. I know. <laughs> you can get all these recipes in Manuel's new book called Peruvian Power Foods. It's available at all bookstores. And you can go to our website, too. We'll give you an idea where to find some of these ingredients. Manuel, thanks so much. Thank you. It'll be nice to see you this morning.